Explain this real quick. Explain this real quick. Oh, great. My kid is going to kill me. It's the birds and bees talk. Okay. Play, play on. Garf. This is only part one. Okay. She wants technical terms. She's really not my kid. The testicles, of which there are two, are hanging out in the scrotum, of which there is one because it is a sac. And it houses the testicles. And this is all located south of or beneath the penis, which is a technical term. Unlike wiener. Your daughter's what, nine? You yeah. should just be glad I'm not saying dick, which is not a technical term, but also refers to the same body part. All right? In my other okay, videos, she'd be saying, referred to as the terrorist. <laughs> it doesn't like to do dishes. Is this considered prejudice that, that you're doing this in a Mexican voice? No, because it's about yeah. gonads. I don't know. Maybe. I, how the semen comes out. I use different. How does it come out? I think I used German earlier. Out of what? Yeah, pee pee. Well, <laughs> pee pee. I don't have to go pee pee. <laughs> it comes out of the penis when the male is very excited. See, there's okay. British. Now. That wasn't British. Point, uh -huh. When the male is very part. excited. Yes, it is. It was kind of Yamish. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Run girl parts so there. You say butt? Yeah. That's how you don't get pregnant. Oh, don't. That's like, that's in, that's advanced <laughs> sex ed. Yeah. Commonly referred to as the entrance to hell. Only if you're not very bright. The uterus. But first it encounters the, oh dear heavens, oh my gosh, what's the word? You talk. Cervix. So that's kind of like the top of the vagina. And then, look, you have to look at my hand motions so you see what I'm talking about. Okay, so there's the vagina. You're driving. Would you duplicate those hand motions? No. You should know what the vagina and cervix are. Just duplicate the hand motions. Steve, if you need a lesson on this, it's out of my league. gate. Like, you ain't coming past here. You don't come in here unless you're a tiny, tiny little sperm and we're trying to get pregnant. But, so that's where the top of the vagina is, right? And then inside your body where, like, nothing goes, like, not your fingers or anything because it's too far inside, it opens up to what's called a uterus. To each his own. Just not past the, the cervix. Your fist or something. Maybe a little bit bigger, huh? like a grapefruit, maybe. I can't remember exactly. But it's not very big, right? It's very stretchy. But it is stretchy. And it can stretch <laughs> if you have a baby. So inside the uterus, right? This is this like spot. Now remember we talked about periods? You driving when you did this? Yes. Okay. So Always a good time for sex. Some multitasking <laughs> little woman. <laughs> And doing hand signals. Yeah. Well, what do you get pulled over all the time? You got pulled over today. Oh my god, because you told me to pull into the police department. I did not. I told you not to do a U-turn. What am I supposed to do? He said no U-turn. All right. I'm busy talking about ovaries, right? Okay. Beetlejuice? No. Beetlejuice? 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 You know the head things? That's sort of like what the fallopian tubes look like. They come off oh. to each side, yeah. and at the end of each fallopian Antennae. tube is yes. what's called an ovary, which is about the size of a walnut. They're not that big. Yes, they are. Whatever. Oh, have you checked yes. yours out lately? I have not checked my ovaries. Yes, I've seen mine. Yours might be slightly smaller since you're only nine. All right, um, your ovaries. 
Inside your ovaries are where lives eggs. Not ones you'll want to scramble, though. <laughs> Technically, well, depends. So, when you were Not just an old fogey's underwear. Born. This is a cool this fact. Is a known fact. This is true. When you were born, let's say you decide to have a baby when you're 35. <laughs> like that what random age when you're 35. Let's say you have a baby when you're 35. The egg that creates that baby was in your body when you were in my belly. Fact. That's pretty phenomenal, huh? Isn't that interesting? So ovaries, and it would be in your So le- the, le- so the egg that created Leah was inside me when my mom was pregnant it. with me. Right? And there's wow. hundreds of thousands of them. Yep. Hundreds of thousands of eggs, right? Is that now, technically month, like something like aliens just pop out through the chest? Normally, <laughs> you have one egg. Yeah, it says the guy who came from an ovary out of his mom's belly that was in her grandmother's. Get said hand I'm just do. Because I'm tired of this ovary. I'm out of here, right? Mm-hmm. And it goes down mm-hmm. to the uterus. Now the uterus, it has <coughs> these really rich, healthy walls, right? Where they have what is it's kind of a special kind of blood. We had to talk it up. Right? Because it's got all kinds so of So she's not freaking out the first time. Rich. Well, exactly. No, no. So you know why? So this little egg is like, I'm out of here, this ovary sucks, it's too crowded, I'm moving. <laughs> and it moves down, it goes into the ovary, and it, I mean into the fallopian tube, and then it goes down into the uterus. Now, if, if the woman does not have sex, which we'll come back to, <laughs> and get a sperm inside there that meets up with the egg that turns it into, you know, an embryo and makes a baby, then the egg is only She's saying I have to stop because we got this conversation with Everett, Marion, and Gina too. Getting closer to the house. Okay, well, <laughs> She's like, gotta uh, stop. So I'm like, oh no. If the egg is not fertilized by a sperm, then it is no good, right? Because it's only half of a thing. And it's kind of like, well, my destiny was to be fertilized. And if I can't be fertilized, I'm just out of here. I'm just going to drown myself. So that's why you have periods. <laughs> Once a month, your egg comes out. And if you don't have a period, worry. (laughs) Well, unless you're 35 and that was your plan. (laughs) True. Doorbell. Doorbell. That could have been the card. Oh, and when it comes out, it comes out with all the blood that would have been there for that baby had that egg and its sperm destiny mate met up. After, if you get child afterwards, would you still be missing the... Okay, so babies live in your body for nine months. Actually, ten. Everyone says it's nine months, but it's really ten. Because you don't know you're pregnant usually for a month. Um, So anyway, yeah, babies live in there for nine months. During that time, you probably won't have a period. Sometimes you'll have a period the first month or two, maybe a very light period or some little tiny bleeding, but not really. Usually. Uh, when I was pregnant with you, I didn't have any bleeding, right? Now, after you have the hey. baby, yeah. it depends. Listen, okay. it depends. Sometimes, some women start having a period right away. Other women, not so much. Usually, if you're breastfeeding, you are less likely to have a period because your hormones are being used to make breast milk instead of making periods. And your body's like, dude, I already got a baby I'm feeding, man. I can't be making no more babies. But don't let that fool you. It is not impossible to make a baby while you're breastfeeding. A lot of people think, oh, well, I can't get pregnant while I'm breastfeeding, so it's okay. Not true. (laughs) Lots of people get pregnant that way. So while you're pregnant, you will very, no, 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 you're not getting out of the car yet. I'm not done. <laughs> While you're pregnant, you will not have a period. This is borderline kidnapping, you know, don't you? 
Yeah, except for you might get saved. True. You probably won't have a period for a while, at least. Typically, I would say it's probably like between three and five months or maybe more, depending on breastfeeding and your genetics and blah, 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 blah. But then you'll start having a period again, probably. And you'll keep having your period until menopause, which is a thing that happens when you're an old lady or older lady. I love how you rephrase that since uh, you're you reaching period, those. Like, Dude, I'm no, my mom didn't even have my past since she was almost 60, man. Um, no, my body is not there yet. It doesn't mean I'm having any babies, but I'm not having menopause, which should be called womenopause. <laughs> so, anyhow, we've covered all that right now. Let's say that the egg that you know comes out in your period, but let's say before you have your period. I, I, I feel sick. I feel sick. <laughs> mom. <laughs> Up and stop curling up when you're driving in a car. <laughs> sit up, sit up, you made her drive again? Yeah. Well, I was parked at this point. He says, well, she was driving a car. Oh, well, yeah. I was drinking. I'm just kidding. Okay, do you feel better? Oh, come on. It's fun, it's fun, it's fun. Knowledge is power. <laughs> I'm really excited. Went to brother or sister. Okay, so Leah, I'll let you go inside, but let's just remember this. So we discussed where eggs are and where sperm are and boy parts and girl parts, right? Yeah. We also generally discussed the idea of sex, but we did not discuss the specifics yet. So we'll come back to that conversation later. Deal? No, I want to go inside. Okay, and we're going to stay in here all night long. Nope. So you either make a deal with me or we're staying here all night and we're talking about sex. Let's talk about sex, baby. Let's talk about... Wait, you have to sing the song with me real quick and then you can get up. Let's talk about sex, baby. Let's talk about you and me. Let's talk about all the good things and the bad things that may be... What, you didn't sing yet? Wait, I didn't hear it. I can't sing that past the first right? verse. Let's talk about sex, baby. Build, huh? Shut up, car. She came I back. Saw 